This video was voted on by the sexy slash classy VIPers over at the Flophouse Lounge. Do you want to force me to play things? Well then check out the link in the description and see how you can customize Destiny itself. Thanks and stay floppy. Hello, welcome again, true believers, to another episode of the Mediocre spider Mat, and you can't say the words mediocre without playing. I already did that last time with um, Edge of Time, but um, we are playing uh, due to the Flophouse VIP requests, the votes, rather, uh, Spider-Man Web of Shadows, finally for the Xbox 360. Which is really weird, because we kind of started this whole series with uh, Web of Shadows on the PS2, of course. The Amazing Allies Edition. Um, this game isn't that much better than that version! I'm gonna be honest, I was really, really hyped for this game. And this, this is it. Um, it's amazing. It's an amazing menu. Uh, things like this pop up in Web of Shadows. But, um... Don't want to dwell on the negatives uh, too much. We'll see them when they happen. But the Spider-Man Web of Shadows, very, very notable because it does have a few pretty cool ideas. One of them being the most elaborate combat. I think maybe more elaborate than Spider-Man PS4. It has been a little while. Um, and it's very unique take on the combat. You can switch between your red and blue and black suits together mid-combo. It's, it's about as Devil May Cry-y as you can get. But let's start a new game. It starts off with... I, I like the start of this, uh, actually, because it starts off very, very subtle, um, you know, for a Spider-Man game. Does to you, you know how it can change you. Yeah, real subtle. Um, so despite the fact this game has a lot, a lot of stupid silliness and a really immature kid-like Spider-Man, um, it has this really edge lordy uh, a story about symbiotes taking over the world. Every single person gets like a symbiote. It's, almost, it's like Planet of the Symbiotes or Venomverse or whatever. It's 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 a pretty horrible story, all things considered. Um, you know, it's, it's few and far between. I don't mind a game that based a, a, a lot around Venom, but, you know, one of the last games uh, was based all around Venom, Ultimate Spider-Man. Um, but that was between Spider-Man. Wait, no, Spider-Man 3 was a lot about Venom too. Never mind, so this would be the third Venom-focused game in a row. What am I saying? Um, but yeah, well, like I did, like I did allude to before, combat is an absolute highlight, and uh, we're gonna jump to a later save game because uh, the combat only gets really, really crazy later on. It takes a good long while uh, for you to start doing some of the more advanced shit. Let's defeat the enemy, shall we? Now I do like that Spider-Man has an aura, aura, aura. Like that's pretty cool. Um, and a lot of his moveset is just generally awesome. Like, almost too awesome for Spider-Man. Look at that! I was doing some crazy fucking garbage! When I see characters like this in an open-world uh, superhero game in general, I'm always a little like, eh. These are shield guys, basically, but there's so many that are like this. Uh, here's the other one of the highlights, is on-the-wall combat, actually. Like I said before, most of the highlights are all about the combat. So, when you're on buildings like this, you have these neat spinning and gliding moves on the building. Uh, no other Spider-Man game I can think of does anything like this, so... It, it's, it's one of these ideas where they have the, this core idea of, like, really elaborate combos and, and style switching, basically. And then, that was kind of it. 
that that's that was it. That's all they really thought of. And there's not really a full-fledged game based around it. There's not much in the way of really interesting varied side quests or anything like that, well, which is kind of sucks in general. Um, because all of almost all of the side quests involve combat in some form or another. There's like one or two uh, missions where it's like, yeah, destroy this or save a person, but they're few and far between. Most of it's all like hit things until they're dead and fight symbiotes. A uh, symbiotes? How did how did Venom pronounce in symbiotes? I, I I always said symbiotes. No, what did I say as a kid? Symbiotes. I don't. What does everyone say? Argue in the comments of the correct pronunciation of this term. Um, what? There's flying symbiotes, you say? Yeah, it's because Vulture gets involved. It's a whole thing. So, what happens if I don't quickly press shoot web? So, look at this erotic pose. We got Spidey going. Hey. We'll try to do them when we come across them, but one of the absolute... Uh, high points for this game is having hilariously bad QTE cutscenes that you can fail. Uh, much like Spider-Man 3, those are out in full fucking force um, and they're hilarious. I'll try to uh, fail as many of them as I can. I can't do these right now because they're baked in. I have to press B. But when I can fail them, I will because it's fucking awesome. Yeah, I saved them. Where is MJ? MJ? I don't understand. Maybe the secondary rendezvous. But Bravo 17. So, Spider Man screaming, Where is MJ? is probably not the best way to keep his secret identity secret. I'm just saying. Uh, this is also kind of teaching you something about uh, one of the, the very, many, very many repetitive missions that happens is just s swinging people to a safe destination. But to be fair, that happens in a lot of Spider-Man games. Where's Cage and his search party? Oh. The civilian volunteers! Pretty redhead, arm in a gas. Ah, you are no help! Oh, that is <laughs> we got vehicles inbound! MJ! Um, when I think back at my time playing this, I think I did beat the game. I, I really can't remember. Um, but this is the definition of a great Spider-Man rental game. Like, I did buy this, but um, if you were to rent it, you would have a really good time just because the combat's so entertaining. Um, but, you know, in terms of beating it, you're not going to get a lot of fun story bits. Certainly, I don't think. Um, because it's not really about Spider-Man or, or anything like that. It's just Venom symbiotes are taking over the, the city. And that's basically it. Uh, there's not really any twist. Peter Parker is not a thing in this game. You don't have anything with your dual identities or anything like that. J. Jonah Jameson isn't in it. Um, MJ is in it as we're screaming at every single motherfucker uh, that doesn't know who this rando person is you're talking about. Oh, look at that. That was good. That was amazing. I love this kick, though. That kick is a strong kick. I like it. Uh, our main goal here is to destroy a gross uh, Venom vagina sack on the wall. Uh, this becomes a big recurring theme in this game, destroying these uh, vagina tremors. Graboids, sorry. Done. So there's Luke Cage and Mary Jane. Let's go. Mary Jane, Mary Jane with her shotgun, you know, the Mary Jane shotgun. Is it really you this time? Come on, we gotta go. Look, look, I promise, I promise, I won't use it. You promise? We are way past that. We ain't got time for this. Oh no, get away. Get away! Come on. Fuck, hands off, Luke. Jesus. You're gonna break her other arm. Don't do it. Just come with me. That Mary Jane is awful. That's that's a great example of how the cutscenes are shot. Mary Jane. 
Peter. 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 It started just like this, four days ago, fighting to breathe, to survive. Harker. Venom. That He's... morning, everything changed. <laughs> this is such a mess. I'm feeling hungry. No. It's your lungs, your pancreas, even your eyeballs. So Venom's just freaking out for some reason, and we get a little Venom, bit of the sy symbiote. Ready for a world of pain. AC Spider-Man gets real pissed when he becomes a symbiote Spider-Man. So let's throw a vehicle, shall we? Regular Spider-Man can throw a car, I thought. Maybe, maybe not. But we constantly pull cars with spider webs and stuff. Maybe we can't. Let's throw another car at Venom. <laughs> I can't move right now, I'm locked in. Okay, that was weird. And here we go. Do it! <laughs> it's kind of a cool Venom design, I don't mind it. I'll throw another car at Venom. And I think that's it. You dare to take the other from me. I will take the girl from you. That's cool. I like that part. Why don't we throw another car at Venom? Because it seems to be his fucking weak point. You know, you know, sonic waves, fire, thrown cars. Brock. Look at me when I talk to you. <laughs> Mary Jane. Thank God. You fucking idiot. Okay. I got your birthday present, but then there was this loud noise and, and... Everything's fine. Let's go. You're gonna be fine. It's a good thing she called present. him Peter right in front of those EMTs. I love my present. You can't click in, so this is how you can do combos, right? Like, you can start them and stop them in either suit. That shit's sick, and it gets even sicker as you go on, so... So this is a game that has uh, web swinging that where it needs to attach to buildings. You can't swing on nothing. Therefore, Central Park is your worst fucking enemy. Just following this to the hospital. Hey, everybody. Here we are at the hospital. Oh no, the drug lords. Everyone in one piece. Get her inside. This is the perfect time to take her out of the ambulance. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm in the middle of a gang war. Good times. MJ was getting her arm in a cast, and I was feeling lousy for not being by her side. But if she knew I was ignoring what was going on in the streets, she would have kicked me back out the door. I don't know, Mary Jane is actually kind of the character that's like, fucking stop doing this sometimes. Uh, so that stomp is fucking cool. Uh, you can also do shit like that. Uh, but I, ha I have almost nothing in this form of, of, of Spider-Man. Oh, more gang war. This was over too quickly. You're gonna pay for messing up my boy, Spider-Feet! Cage. It's Cage! You can shoot him now! His show has been cancelled! Like, if you know it's Luke Cage, why would you shoot him? Like, if you know that much about him? Bad why does he like yellow so much? So you can see Cage is kind of doing the ally shit right now. Uh, with his really jerky animation. It's fine. I killed that motherfucker. <laughs> so holding LT sends out a, a seductive pulse 
It shows you where everyone, uh, every, like, enemy is. That was pretty cool, actually. Find Luke Cage. I don't know. Does any does anyone know where I left my seven-foot-tall, unbreakable black man? So what brings you uptown, Spidey? So, yeah, you have these kind of dialogue sections with characters, and, um, yeah, that's basically it. I was coming to see about a friend in the emergency room when all these fine chaps came along. <coughs> uh, here's also our main collectible in the game. Uh, the spider collectibles increase Spider-Man's swing speed and the size of your health and special meters. There's about a thousand of these in the uh, game world. They're all over the place. I mean, like like orbs and crackdown all over. Um, <laughs> from the last point I recall when I was playing this game when it was new, I had like over 500 of them, maybe six or 100, I forget, and there are still like 200 left, and there's like to get one level up, it gets longer and longer, so you have to collect like 300 of them before you get a single level up. Just slapping Luke Cage's dick. Alright, let's kill this guy. Wow, that's actually pretty cool, he, he hung on to the edge of tomorrow. So I got his soul. His soul is going to, it's mine now! More crimes over here. Uh, hello. Die. What? It missed! I'm Spider-Man. Whoa, he's okay? Holy shit! I got some black points. Huh. I guess I'm not allowed to crawl up walls while holding a civilian. What the? <laughs> oh, we can get some stuff going. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, that was amazing. So in Spider-Man uh, Web of Shadows for the PS2, you could have like uh, black suit answers and red suit answers. Basically, you're being a dick during dialogue trees. Uh, so you could get some points that way. Um, you know, just by talking to characters and kind of being like a huge like spider donger and just be like, yo, fuck you, like, give me the money or whatever. Or just like, yo, I'm Spider-Man. And then you just get red points that way. And I kind of wish that was in here because you do wind up talking with certain characters a lot when you're getting side missions and shit. It would have been a nice little touch. Hey, Luke, what did you mean when you said I had unique skills? You're Peter- you're Spider-Man! You have the potential to be a great fighter, but you need to use all your senses. Hey, I've got more sense than you. I think Spider-Man's been around longer than Luke K anyway. Excuse me? You know, my spider sense. One of these days I'll think of something cooler to call it. No, it's fine. Then. Don't don't discourage yourself. So yeah, this is basically all tutorial stuff. I kind of do want to get a bit farther into the games where uh, more heroes start popping up because there's this hilariously out of left field uh, section that involves an X-Man. Um, you'd probably know which X-Men if you see the really bad box art for this game. This is the place. Ooh. So many people though. Spider-Sense, do your thing. Who is evil? Because that's how Spider-Sense works. <laughs> you all in one piece? Man, how are you big time? Thanks, Don't I have to me. go back Thanks to Def Jam Vendetta. Okay, little dude, wait here. What? Now come at me from there, hard as you can. So this is gonna be like the main technique of this game, which is basically webbing to your target and then punching them, so... You can chain that like a motherfucker from enemy to uh, enemy. I can't do this! Come on now! Don't quit on me! Try I didn't quit! Focus. I- I completed it! So let's try this shit against real thugs. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, there's one over there. Yes! Oh, shit! See, this part's really awesome of the game, and then all that over-countering stuff comes in, and uh, when you're doing, like, you know, bosses and stuff, they really don't get fooled by this, so you have to do it uh, shitloads and just know and uh, recognize when your uh, web line gets shattered. It becomes a real thing. What? What is with these doors? <laughs> 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 
this game is bonkers. There's just something with these walls that are like vicious. They're attacking me. I don't know. Ooh. Ooh. And then... Look at that. Look at that. That's what I'm fucking talking about. Wait, 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 whoa, there's some shit. There's some quantum realm shit going on in here. Why? Nice going, Spidey. That web stuff is working for you. Yeah, it's kind of my thing. Oh shit. I want to be like them when I grow up. What is this? Is this Saints Row? What? Remember what? What what? I'm just gonna throw cars at things until the mission's done. I I think I'm disabling them. Fully disabled! These cars will never get anyone to a location ever again. I've saved the gas station. I'm a hero. Gotta use the big swing kick. I... They've also been thwarted. Like, sometimes the streets in this city are just really, really empty. Like, there's lots of people over there, but just other places there's just not. I, I guess they're not spawning in fast enough. Or they're spawning away from me. What the fuck? I've never seen that. That's a big thug. Oh, that was cool. Yes, there is. It's, it's, it's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's what I'm talking about! Ugh. Don't worry, officer, I'll get your car to where it needs to go. There you go. That's good. He's okay, folks. He's just doing his thing in there. So you can't pick up cars as regular Spider-Man. So that's another difference between the two action. Whoa, that was crazy. <laughs> All right, let's do a big swinging kick swing. That worked out pretty well. There's so many snipers, why do they need like 80 of them that shoot two guys? There's more! They did not want this parlay to happen! This guy's a pro. Yeah. Who sent him? Was he a pro though? Oh no. The whole gang war was a setup. Oh, there's, there's a second wave of snipers. 21 more snipers. So, in total, there was like 42 snipers. Like, I know they want to teach me this mechanic, but I, I think that other section kind of nailed it. Alright, last sniper, for fuck's sake. There better not be a third wave. Oh, talk, Cage. Yeah, that's literally what a parlay is, dude. We had a deal. I gotta do what I gotta do. With or without me, my crew is taking down the sevens. I said no guns. That was that was Steve Bloom. Hey, so finally we have a choice. I'm gonna be evil Spidey. I'm gonna dance a whole shitload. Yeah, yeah. So it just let you choose to be that Spidey, like, for that battle. Not the coolest, but it's fine. I should throw more cop cars is what I should do. Oh, that didn't work. Okay, I may have killed a couple of cops there. Oh, there's still, like, four, like one fucking guy left. Dude, give it up. There's, like, 80 cops in me. Oh, did you see that fucking move? The streets are gonna be safe, gentlemen. What are you doing? This solves nothing! Actually, Luke, this solves everything. These losers have been played. Somebody had their relatives murdered to start a nice turf war. 
How'd you know that? More than willing what? To apply. You knew this whole turf war was a setup? You asked me to clean up the streets, and that's exactly what I did. Ooh, he's evil Spider Man. The armor on those assassins in the park meant they were from a well financed organization. I thought I would start with the richest crime boss in town and work my way down. That meant Mr. Wilson Fisk, the king bit. Oh, shit. I decided to head for the Fisk building, take a look around, and then see MJ in the morning. Of course, in my life, nothing seems to go as planned. All right, so we're on top of Fisk Tower, and uh, guess what? Black Cat, uh, 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 uh Chateau Noir, AC. Um, and we have to kind of chase her. Hey, crazy woman. Does this remind oh, you of any other Spider-Man game? Just if you know of one, man. let me know. I can't think of any. Can you? Hello, I'm right. I'm right here. Are you okay, Black Cat? Very impressive flips, honey. I can get there. I can get there. I'm faster than you. Uh, Art heat wall zip. I know. She's right there. Look at her go. The black cat, Felicia Hardy. Up to her pretty little eyeballs in trouble again, no doubt. Pretty little eyeballs is gross. She was. What why was that introduction to you? What I'm the hell is that? This. It can't be. What is that stuff floating in the air? Defeat her escort. I guess it was just webbing from the old Who are her cohorts? Or her escort, sorry. I guess they're just other black cats? Just Iron Men, I guess. Oh, okay. Oh, come on, guys. There's only one of me, and there's like... What the hell are these assholes? What? Drop the device at once. Moon Knight? Moon Knight? Drop the device at once. That's Robin Atkins Downs! It's Travis Touchdown! You were present at the robbery. And trying to stop it? Now let's chase all the robbers! You speak the truth to Kanchu. Let us pursue them. I thought I was nuts. I can't believe I forgot that Moon Knight was in this. Moon Knight's fucking cool. Anyone, let me know in the comments what Moon Knight comics are good, because I have no idea. Like, I know he's kind of a spotty hero, like, he doesn't have a lot of great shit. Uh, maybe I'm wrong about that, I don't know, but, uh, I, I, I kind of, I never really hear about him that often. I'd love Moon Knight Hello, to, like, lover. have a movie. Isn't it a beautiful night? No flirt. I believe that's Jennifer Hale as Black Cash. She's... This? Done the role a lot ever since Spider Man on the PlayStation 1. I want you. Yeah, yeah, every time that web breaks, I know. Oh, shit, sorry there, Black Cat. What? Gross! Cooties! Okay, well, she's. She's kind of fucking around, but that's okay. All right, all right, all right. Kitty, forget to retract her claws. Knock it off, cat. She's literally going like you didn't win. I beat her twice now. Oh, contrary, more. I know exactly what I. <gasps> Ow! Holy shit! That move, that attack was cool. Okay, Felicia, please just stop. <laughs> yeah, please just stop. Please. Man, this is a long fight. All right, if this is the QTA, I can't fuck it up. Meaning I gotta fuck it up. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, be the QTA. Are you okay? I told you to lay off. <laughs> I'm dead. Are you okay? I told you to lay off. I gotta fuck up everyone. You okay? I told you to lay off. All right, let's see the next one. Cat! All right, I'll save her. Don't snap her neck now. Gotcha. 
Oh, this is the best. Are you okay? I told you to lay off. <laughs> like, why do they make them so funny? The fucking Azuna drop. Gotcha. Oh, that was great. This is fucking. Bu oh shit! All right, what was this all about? Alicia, you in there? Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. I'm right here. She's you right idiot. there, you idiot. <laughs> uh, so, are you okay? I'm not sure what's going on. Look, I'm a screw up, okay? You think? You do a heist for Kingpin, try to kill me. I was working from the inside. I got in over my head and I couldn't get out of it, and then you show up way too early and I get this huge rush from seeing you. You attack me? And what do you mean I showed up early? I was doing it for you. What? You would see that we were made for each other. Yeah. <sighs> Always I'm the sorry. same story of Black Cat. I had no idea you still felt like that. Really? Well, guess what? I do. I still love you. <sighs> Look at us. Wearing these stupid masks. Yeah. <laughs> Who are we really? We have all these powers and act like we're ashamed of them. He's wearing a mask. Be with me. Together we can be whatever we want. Free from want. Free from responsibility. Free to have fun. Yeah, fuck your old fun, Uncle you? May. Yeah! Aw, oh, shit! I'm gonna take the black suit, because he's into that shit. You're right. I could use a little more fun in my life. Yeah. I love how he does a voice thing. Yeah. Yeah. I promise you this whole city... I can cut yours. a dick hole in my really? dick hole. Yep. And I know just who to take it from. Mmm, big guy wearing a cravat. That's right. Like, what if, what if, there should be a what if comic. What if Spider-Man just fucks Black Cat? Or what if Black Cat fucks Spider-Man? And then that's it. That's the comic. That's it. It's just a porno, basically. Hey, Black Cat, what's up? So, you ready to rain on Kingpin's parade? Maybe. Do tell. The fat man has built this high-tech army, and tonight they're launching a bunch of heists. Heist? Your specialty? All right, go on. He's got some scheme to take out all these high-tech firms, steal their technology, computers, data, all that stuff. Aw, oh, man, these missions are really long, though. Did he ever mention why? So, I'm gonna be upfront. Like, this part of the game um, is all fine. It's good, even. Uh, it's a fun time. Uh, it's at where the halfway point of the game where the city changes. We might do a few more missions and then I'll switch over to that save file because that's where the game kind of takes this really repetitive nature. Alright, defeated all the wall drills and all these iron men. I have to return to Black Cat and I, I guess we'll fuck? I don't know. Now that I took Black Spider-Man, I guess anything's possible. Nice work, Spider-Man. Now, what shall be your reward? I'm sure you'll think of something mutually rewarding. <laughs> okay, I'm at the Daily Bugle. Black Cat wants me here, but there's no JJJ, so uh, I don't know. It's now also night daytime. I've got a feeling that the Bugle is not the target. What is this now? It's the courthouse. Clever, using the bugle as a false lead. Was it clever? Oh, who's here? Please tell me it's a villain. No. No, just these generico guys. Spams! Spider-Man sighted! Get him! <laughs> It sounded like Yuri Lowenthal. Yeah, 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 lots of juggles. I like that. Oh. Yes! Look at this! Awesome. Return fire! Keep them busy! They're surrounding the building! We don't have enough firepower! Ugh. What's happening? Get to the wow. They're trying to blow wow. the courthouse. 
What is hap- what is this? Alright, so I gotta get the bomb. Oh, fuck. Alright, thank you, little disposal unit. Alright, so... You know you're playing a superhero video game where there's a big mecha giant robot you gotta defeat. So let's defeat the big... Throw cars at the tech mech. Oh, okay. Alright, throw in a car at the tech mech now. Why do why I gotta press X? Just get me over there! Oh, because he's damaged from the car I threw, I guess. Oh, fuck! <laughs> okay, I've taken one weapon away. At least I'm saving the courthouse. Oh god, there's two mechs. Can I drive it? No, let me drive it. Oh. Okay. It feels like it's gonna blow up, which isn't good. Did the game just crash? I can't even guide out. Motherfucker! Alright, we're back. Um, I, uh, jumped forward to my much later save in the game, cause that crash, um, was kind of a, uh, a fortune teller maybe telling me I, I should move on, so... Symbiotes have taken over everything. Uh, we have Mrs. Personality herself, Black Widow, now giving missions. The Shield Helicarrier is up there, and the entire city is under quarantine. Because there's just symbiotes everywhere, so there's no longer any people um, in the crowd. Uh, there, there's no civilians. It's just all symbiotes, so it's all fighting all the time. Um, and it's not, it's not amazing. I, I really don't like this particular part of the game. This happens around the, I don't know, 60% mark. You have a big fight with Venom, and Venom just becomes a giant monster and just gets all these little seedlings, sprinkles uh, sperm dust everywhere. So yeah, I see this green dust. It's like, yeah, I'm gonna fight. I'm gonna fight some, some symbiotes now. Ah, oh, shit. All right, this is the hero I want. I've called in Wolverine. Because Activision owned the license for X-Men comics at the time. He's quite fast. Berserker Barrage. Okay, well, he just ran over Wolverine. That's cool. So basically, like, every mission at this point in the game just comes down to fighting symbiotes. Uh, really, that's, that's the main thing, I guess. I mean, we got to fight them all. we got to fight them a lot. And you just keep fighting. Holy shit! I didn't even know you could do that. Now, I've never played the Wii version of this game. Some people have told me it's... I think it's really bad. I have to imagine, like, technically, it's real shit. Because uh, it is the same game. It's just on the Wii, so I can't imagine it doing this open world uh, any favors. Where are you up here? What is this? Should I beat this up? What, where are you? I totally forget the story at this point. This is Shield APC what is this? We see you down there, Spidey. Protect those civilians in the park until we can land. And then we'll work together to get them to safety. Why can't you just save them? These guys that are having this fucking dance off. You idiots. Defend group and okay, okay, put them down, I guess. We just gotta defend group. Attack the symbiote, Spider-Man, now! Oh shit, the symbiotes! I haven't seen them there. This is a weird-ass mission. Okay, I'll just bring one over. How about I just bring one over to you, and then he can do his shit. There you go. No, don't come back here, idiot! Go to the APC! A civilian has been captured. Great. Now, just go over here. Dude, there. Go inside. Don't run away from the APC! Ah, oh, fuck it. So that was Spider-Man, Web of Shadows. I really didn't want to do that mission. And all of them are like that in the uh, Venom Apocalypse. But, uh, you know, going back to this, honestly, the combat is so much fun, especially after you get, like, you know, a couple of moves. I was, I was really digging that. But, like, the core game itself, 
uh, really kind of peters out and just gets to kind of sort of be a mess after a little while. Still not a terrible Spider-Man. Like, it's not even close to, like, the levels of Spider-Man 3 or whatever. Um, it has some nice ideas, but I just kind of wish it was a bit more polished in a lot of areas. I wish the story and the voice acting were better. Um, just a bit more interesting, because just it all revolving around Venom is a little much for me. But um, I still enjoyed playing it quite a bit. If you guys know of any other Spider-Man games, uh, you, know, you know, keep an eye on the Flophouse VIP. Uh, this was actually a uh, voted on a Spider-Man game that some of the uh, VIPers let me know they wanted to see. I also had Spider-Man uh, Mysterio's Menace on the GBA and Spider-Man uh, Return of the Sinister Six on the NES in there. But this kind of won out, so we'll see what we play next on the Mediocre Spider-Man. 